Well, switching gears now, golfers are invited to tee up in support of literacy programs and efforts right here in Palm Beach County. In fact, this Friday kicks off the 7th Annual Literacy Links Golf Tournament. Here with us today, the CEO of the Literacy Coalition of Palm Beach County, uh, Kristen Calder. Thank you so much for being here. We were both watching the weather uh, as <laughs> yes. Sandra was going there, yes. but I have a Come feeling on, Sandra. Let's Friday. get this going. I think it's going to be great. Uh, Friday. Tell us, so the 7th Annual Golf Tournament, tell us about it. Yeah, so it's our 7th Annual Literacy Links, and the idea is that um, it's providing links for literacy mm -hmm. for adults, children, and families in our community that are struggling to read, struggling to learn English, to get their GED, and to go on to have a, a more successful, better life. And so the people who are taking part in this, the money, it's going to all benefit the Literacy Coalition yeah, of Palm so Beach County. Absolutely. We have nine programs from Jupiter to mm -hmm. Boca Raton and Alta Bell Glade. Um, we have over 200 volunteers right now that are helping um, first, second, and third grade students. Uh, improve their reading skills so they can read on grade level. You know, that's a, a national but also local statistic that nearly half of all the students in Palm Beach County aren't reading on grade level. So, and the pandemic obviously created further setbacks. So, a, our tournament and events like this and supporting the Literacy Coalition just help support that cause and our efforts to help more students learn how to read. I, that was going to be my, my follow-up question was, I, I know that you guys have always been so important to our community, but um, my husband's a teacher. He talks about it all the time. Time, the pandemic really set us back. Yeah, so we're seeing second graders reading on a kindergarten sure. level. And so that means that we have to work even harder, recruit more volunteers. We partner with the school district, with the library system, um, just to complement the services and also um, recruit people to come in and help, you know, that can be a part of the solution. A lot of it's one-on-one -on -one time that our tutors spend with children, um, our programs that get kids excited about reading, mm -hmm. and then also the adult literacy component and working with family literacy so that the cycle can, um, you know, be broken so that the parents can then learn how to read, can speak English, read English, and then be able to support their children in their education. Someone watching right now and thinks that they might have a child or someone in their life that could benefit from one of these programs, how do they qualify? How do they get involved? So our Building Better Readers program where we're working with students, um, we're in 31 schools in Palm Beach County, so likely we're at your child's school. We also, on Tuesdays and Thursdays at our Bloom Literacy Center in Boynton Beach, offer this free tutoring. Uh, we also, in our programs, throughout the county. Basically, if you call us, tell us your need, we will try to direct you, whether it's us or one of our partners that can help. Um, we really want to help everyone improve their, their literacy and reading skills. And, and perhaps you're watching thinking, wow, I'd really like to help. What a great cause. And I'd love to play golf too. So can you still sign up? Yeah, we have a few spots available um, at the Palm Beach Par 3 this Friday, okay. April 14th. It's going to, um, you know, it's a beautiful course, rain or shine. Yeah. And um, yeah, so you can still sign up to play. We take book donations, um, donations to support the efforts, and then volunteers. We're always recruiting. Wonderful. I was on your website earlier this morning. You do have a lot of information. So if you're interested, just to learn more, go on there, check it out. If you want more information about the golf tournament literacy links the tournament the seventh annual again it's this friday and we've got all the information on our website wpbf.com we'll link them right there to make it nice and easy for them thank you so much for thank always you, being Aaron. here we love having you here